Yo guys, what is up? Slim Shiny Gaming here. I hope you guys are having an amazing and fabulous day. I know I am. I hope you guys are having an even more fabulous day. You know what I mean, man? Anyways, guys, here to bring you possibly my favorite mobile game of all time. It's called uh, Critical uh, Critical Strike. Yeah, it's called Critical Strike Portable. It's just a very freaking fun game. Like, no words to describe it, man. It's just that crazy. It's called, um, if you want to get on Android, it's called Critical Strike. On, uh, iOS, it's called, um, let me see right here. I think it's called, it's like SWAT some, it's called Critical Missions. And then after that, it's SWAT. But I don't even know why they changed the names between that. It's kind of funny. Now, um, the reason why I speak about this and the reason why I even brought, like, a mobile game like this up is just because of how freaking amazing it is. Like, there hasn't been any mobile game out there that made me, like, oh! <gasps> I gotta show this to people like there never been a mobile game like that until this uh, game that came out now I just don't know why it's just that freaking amazing of a game because um, this like I feel like this is a combination of a whole ton of games in one in a way but uh, I want to get to the chase of this game just so you guys can get some little bit brief info on it you know before you guys download it it is free though so just letting you guys know that before anything um, so usually what this game is supposed to be it's supposed to be like a um, CSGO clown clone, but I have to say it's a it's a really good clone. Uh, the Critical um, Strike team, they also made another game. Uh, if you just look up Critical Strike, it'll, the game will probably be under that, or they'll just show an advertisement on this game showing you their uh, other game that they have, which is more like the original CSGO that there is now. This is just based off the original Counter-Strike. Uh, I think I said the original CSGO or something earlier, just a couple seconds ago. That was kind of... I, I didn't mean that, boy. I didn't mean that at all. I meant the original kind of strike. Um, so, the game modes that uh, you'll be playing in this is usually the original game modes that you'll be playing on the original Counter-Strike, such as uh, Classic. And uh, there's a whole bunch of other added game modes just for this game right here, uh, which is TDM and... I forgot all the other game modes, just a whole bunch of other multiplayer game modes. Uh, one, it's kind of like Infected from Modern Warfare, just that these are actually zombies and you're not like a guy holding a gun and a knife throwing a boat you know tomahawks in the air but uh you're just gonna be a zombie just going after someone and then just trying to kill them um kind of i don't know it kind of reminds me of left for dead a little bit when it come came to the um, one game mode i think that was called infected as well can't fully remember but um because it's been a while since i played that game but um uh, there's also the zombie survival game mode. In my opinion, that's probably my favorite game mode out of all, especially when playing with friends. It's just so fun. Uh, there is controller compatibility for this game, so just letting you know, too, that the controls are very weird. I just hope they add um, controller configuration. I did mention that to the developers on the Play Store, so hopefully they do see that and they do bring that to mind and then do that for us because I have to say, using like a controller for this game is like heaven than just using your hands because using your hands too it's still really good i just like using controllers a lot more than touchscreen controls because i've never been a fan of touchscreen controls but the touchscreen controls for this game aren't that bad to be honest so if you don't have any controller then this game is still great for just playing regularly so um pros uh there is a lot of weapons as well that you can try i really hope they do have more maybe add some skins like they do in their other games um that's like csgo so um, a lot of the weapons, they're very similar to the original Counter-Strike as well. Like I said, this is like a uh, CS clone. So you're going to be seeing a lot of weapons from the game that are just like its original counterpart. Like you see the sniper right here, it's just like the one from the game. It, I have to say though, it's so fun to use. This is probably the best, you know, my favorite weapon to use in the game. Um, there is no laggy problems I've been having with the game. There's, no, I haven't ran into any problems. My one friend did have a problem when it came to signing in. Because you also can, um, when you go on the multiplayer, you have to make an account. You don't have to do any verification or anything. So you can put in, like, some random email or, or something like that. That's what I did. And there's really no big deal upon that. And you also can make clans. So if you ever want to um, play with me on here, you definitely can. Um, but I'm going to get to the, one of the probably, probably one of the best things about this. That a lot of mobile games do not do at all. Probably the best thing that I think about this game is just the custom maps where you can upload and play custom maps. It's just that, it's just freaking awesome. I'm playing on the Simpsons map right now. It's called Homer House. I don't know why they even name it that. I always find the names kind of funky, 
but um, I have to say this is just so fun to play. Just imagine you and your friend just going off killing zombies at this freaking Simpsons home. Now, when it came down to um, custom maps and all, it kind of reminded me a little bit more of Killing Floor when it came down to this, like Killing Floor and see uh, Counter Strike forming together, making like some kind of Siamese twin or something. Um, and you know that's basically how it felt to me, but it's just it's just so fun. I really like too how like you pull out the knife, how you like twirl it like you do in the game. It's just fun doing that. Just twirl it out and then kill a zombie right away. It just looks freaking cool as ever. Um. But much other than that, not really anything too much other than all those. It's just like, just like killing zombies on here and just, you know, playing the game. Just, it's just so fun. No words to describe it. You just, it's just a good time. Especially when you're playing with friends. I really wish more, uh, more people play this. It's just, it really needs more people playing. Um, there has been like around 10, I think it's been 1 to 10, I can't remember how many downloads. I think it was like 10 million, I think. But just like from whatever I'm playing, it just looks like only a you know a couple hundred on. I'm kind of surprised by uh, looking at that. Um, but like I said, I really do hope they add some skins into this. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of multiplayer gameplay now. Um, I have been playing with bots because for some reason I just couldn't connect to online servers, and uh, I you know it was kind of late at night, so I just wanted to get a little bit of quick gameplay with some bots. I have to do. I have to really say too. If you're using a controller online, you have a big chance of doing a lot better than everyone because you're using touchscreen controls. Why are you sitting there with a controller able to be steady and calm when it comes to aiming? Instead, when you're using your um, thumb, when you're using the touchscreen, you may like wiggle a little bit. Um, I think I said um like like five or six times now. What am I doing here? Just like walk out of here. Just app. Just walk out. Yeah, I, I, I'm just out of here. Just quit. Out. Gone. Out, out of the... Out of water. Fish out of water. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, um... This... I also wanted to say something, too. Uh, to bring this to your attention. Just as a little bit of a quick... Up, quick you know, quick update as well. Because I would just wanted to talk about it since, you know, I'm bringing a little bit of this gameplay into here. Might as well talk a little bit about, um, what I'm about to be doing. Because, um, since I haven't been uploading for, like, five days, I've been feeling really bad about it. I've been really wanting to upload, but I just haven't been really feeling my best. Because I, uh, kind of just fell down on some bleachers the one day. Kind of scraped up my leg a little bit. Kind of, um, hurt it a little bit as well. So, i kind of been just sitting out a little bit. I've been making sure I've been getting, you know, back in the shape a little bit, too. So, I feel like I'm doing a little bit better. I feel like I'm, a, you know, able to be positive. Make a video for you guys, because, you know, I don't want to be making a video of me sounding negative be like hey guys uh, welcome to the video uh, Slim Shane came here um, so uh, yeah in this video today nah I don't want to be like that I want to be a little bit up a little bit hype you know cause I, I, I just want to show you guys some cool stuff um so off to uh, what I was talking about uh, there's been a lot of stuff I wanted to talk to you guys about one of them is um, a top 10 intro giveaway cause I know that a lot of people do really need intros out there that you know just don't have access to a computer to make those cool 3d intros now i'm not gonna be making those like you know blender kind of ones because i don't have a pc as well windows pc but i do have one where i can uh try to make just some you know 3d intros for you guys which look really good one of them i uh made with that on my chromebox the well, one that you see in the intro all the way at the beginning of this video so if you ever want to look at that, you can. If you want to get, you know, something very similar like mine, let's say if you want to have the same type of intro that I do, you always can just let me know um, if you win the giveaway. Because uh, I'm going to probably do 10 to 15 people. You can probably let me know in the comments below how many people should um, be winners in this. I'm probably just going to put 15, uh, possibly, maybe less, depending on how many people want to participate. Now, there's not really too much you have to do with that, but I'll explain more about that in a later video. Now, another thing I've been wanting to do, which I thought been really cool, I've been thinking about it the whole freaking week. it just been running through my mind. I'm like, what if I did, you know, a fun tech geeky week where I just show off a lot of cool stuff that involves in electronics? Now, I don't mean anything like things like oscilloscopes or anything like that or, you know, digital multimeters, not like that kind of stuff. I mean, like... Things like, you know, you just don't really see when uh, you, you know, see someone playing games or uh, doing anything in general. Uh, one of them is um, this little fridge that 
I had or got from Goodwill. I don't know if you know what Goodwill is. If you don't, it's just the thrift store, basically. Uh, we got this little USB fridge, and it looked like a jug machine, but it was not really anything too, too close to it. I'll probably show a screenshot in that video when I do show it off. Uh, and I come, you know, my mother uh, kind of completely changed from a red, you know, red, red play machine to the actual juggernaut machine, which looks so cool compared to that. Now, like I said, it's the same size. It just holds one can, but it's, and, oh my God, it's just so cool to have for like a setup. Maybe if you're at an office or something like that, if you want to show something like that off. Uh, even when you open it, it has like a blue light in there. I might try to see if I could change it to a red light if that's possible. Uh, see if I could probably modify it maybe sometime in the future. Uh, another thing that I want to be shown is playing Xbox 360 through like, through like a four or five inch BMW TV. So it's just all going to be in black and white. And we're going to try to see if it works because it's something that I've been wanting to experiment with. Another thing that I want to show is um, with that same TV, it show off some audio splitters with uh, dual speakers <laughs> just to see how that goes. I also want to show you guys too a Game Boy um a Game Boy from the ninth from 1989, uh, using an audio splitter as well, and using it on one of these speakers that actually has water visualization, where when music plays, the water you know kind of rises up inside um, a little glass container. And there's a few more things I do want to show you guys. Uh, I'm also going to try to see if I can get back onto the YouTube upload schedule. I don't know if you guys forgot about that or not, um, but I want to get onto that schedule. I just been wanting to get all this stuff out first before anything in general. Um, also, too, I want to give a little bit of an update to my Color Clan. Uh, the Color Clan has actually been doing very well lately. We've got um, a couple introductions up. If you guys definitely do want to check it out, you always can just type in Color Clan, and that will be one of the first things to pop up if you search up channels and then Color Clan. And that would be one of the top things. It'll just show uh, little um, kind of square boxes, a red and blue one, and then a rainbow background that says Color Clan. Uh, they're not, you know, they're rhombuses. Or if you want to be very typical here, just call them parallelograms. Either way you want to put it. Um, but uh, the channel's going pretty well. I need to make a new cover photo for it. I never really got to. Uh, I did make an outro for the uh, Color Clan, though. It's kind of like an outro and intro at the same time. I'll be using it as an intro for... A lot of videos basically but i'm trying to get a lot more introductions up of people that do want to have theirs up to show their self off for uh everyone so everybody knows how they are what they like to play and all most of us like playing black ops 3 so you're going to be seeing a lot of black ops 3 clips in there mostly um a couple of people like to do things you know for example like geometry dash maybe uh the division by you know the division tom clancy or um uh, and you know a couple other stuff like street fighter all that good stuff. Um, but anyways, I just wanted to sh you know, tell you guys about this freaking amazing game. And I just want to give you guys a quick update on the future if you guys are ready for it. And uh, like I've said before too, I'm going to talk about that um, top 10 intro giveaway uh, probably in my next video. So if you guys want to be the um, you know, people to try to get started with it right away, just make sure you're prepared tomorrow for when that video comes up. So you know what you have to do in order to participate. It's nothing really too big at all. You don't have to do no dumb crap when it comes to surveys and all. Nothing like that. Um, I might do like a little bit, maybe a little quick survey. I don't know. Uh, it's not going to be like anything too big where you put in your info information or anything. I'm not going to be doing anything like that kind of survey. It's just going to be questions. Just a couple questions I uh, may want to ask you or something like that. I'll see what I uh, want to do. Um, but anyways, ju you know, just be prepared for that for whenever you are ready to see it i don't even know if you guys are even this far in the video if you are then oh my god man like i i, I congrats you man just like i could give you a handshake right now I'm, it's gonna be like forrest gump like handshake in the president's hand man it's it's like that crazy i'm like forrest gump shaking your hand like dang like damn um but anyways guys i'm gonna bring you just you know just let you guys watch the rest of the gameplay right here so you guys know what this game is like just me you know screwing around killing bots very fun and like i said it's free on the app store and it's free on the play store as well so anyways have a great day guys and peace